is the kind of assignment you don't get every day. A personal invitation from Tina Turner to come on down to rehearsal and have a chat. Well, I did, and let me tell you, I may never be the same. Yes, that's me, front row center at the greatest private rock concert you could ever imagine. You hip, sexy, got the moves, still full of life. I think I have I a fan here. Wow. <laughs> you gonna be good to me? I'll be good to you. <laughs> How do you stay so hip? I mean, <laughs> you are so down with it. <laughs> Am you I do. really hip? You are. Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> oh. Those girls on stage backing you up you have a whole hard time holding a candle. I know what you're telling me. You're saying to me, you're 70 years old. <laughs> I know that's what you want to say, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah. she's down with it. Next year, I am. I'm 70 years old. If this is what pushing 70 looks like, sign me up. I just have energy. It, this, I do nothing. I've never done drugs. A little wine, champagne on off days, and not even now on off yeah. days. But uh, no, I just don't need this. Is I was born with this. What she was born with is undeniable talent, unbelievable legs. She's gained superstar fans like Oprah and kept an ageless spirit. During our three and a half hour visit, Tina never stopped. During a break, she calls her longtime manager, Roger Davies, close for a confidential chat. She's coming out of eight years in retirement, roaring back for a six month tour, kicking off October 1st in Kansas City. Let's just say she feels it. The initial shock is over. The girls and I have been sore. And um, <laughs> yeah, we're ready because I've got fans way back from the Ike and Tina days. So they're going to be the 70 year olds and down. <laughs> so we, we arranged that intermission for them so they can take a little break and go and fan and have some water. And her website, TinaTurnerLive.com, has more info about this tour that could stretch her into her seventh decade. When the show goes away, what's the next chapter be, to be written for Tina Turner? Well, that's interesting. I think I'll probably live to be 100. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, yeah, I, I think it's going to be interesting for all of us to see what's beyond for me. I don't doubt for a second that you'll live to be 100. Now, tomorrow, an entire family of singers, the Osmonds.